bit too late. All right, let's do this. Does it say I'm live yet? Here we go. All right, it says on air, what's happening, everybody? Jay Shockblast here. And we are about to do that Beauty and the Beast. And, uh, yeah, man, we got uh, Beast and Magic about to come live and direct. Uh, sorry, I'm a little late starting. I, uh, <laughs> I, I was, like, spending so much time making the thumbnail. And I got it, like, just in time. So, uh, here we go. Let's let everybody load on in. We're going to go ahead and tweet this out. Calling this the Beauty and the Beast. Because we got ourselves Beast. And we got ourselves Magic. Got that Phoenix Force Magic costume. Um, You're like a Blackwater version love this of costume. Man. It's one of my favorite costumes in the game. So, I figured, what the heck. I'm going to go ahead and get it. Do my thing. And, uh, sweet. So... Uh, let's go ahead and get that active. So, uh, once again, um, got some cool things going on. And what else we got? Um, yeah, so let's go ahead and uh, let's say what's happened Chris Masterson, what's happened in Xylox, what's happened in the Panther, what's happened in BT the Gamer, what's happened in Lord Yin, what's happened in Rogelio Pena, the Red Ranger. SAO fan, Dartha Coco, tap in Shadow Drive 316, WPC King Killshot, tap in Aiden Horn, tap in Kaleo, Kaleo Fievel Forever, I don't know if I said that right, tap in Rogue, aka Matt Man of Master, uh, what's happening, Spider Ghost, Screen Chat, Archer White, William Hunter, uh, Max Gamer, I think I got everybody so far. Uh, so, still says live in five minutes for you. Hmm. Well, I'm started. So, uh, the Inhumans look like they found some cheap costumes laying around at Walmart for Hall <laughs> a month after Halloween. Man. Uh, what's happening, Jose? Uh, Karis? What's happening, Sabrina? What's happening, Disciple Ophir? Hello. Tapping in Kenny Bang? What's happening, Mr. Reaper 2003? What's happening, Drew 2097? Shout out to the Drew 2097 because I think I actually have uh, two codes. So uh, let's go ahead and uh, look in my. Yeah, I got two codes we can give away um, for North America, you know, unfortunately, uh, for anybody that's European looking for one. But uh, we do like, uh, we do have two codes anyway. Um, tapping in Kevin Glamorous. Um, so it's happening, uh, Donnie the Gamer. And I think we got pretty much everybody so far. So, um, cool, man. I don't know if you guys saw the other day, but uh, I just started doing something where we've got... I'm going to show you. This is what happens when uh, I get a new subscriber. Ready for this? Test. Oh, yeah. I just subscribed to my own channel. Woot, woot. And then whenever anybody wants to hit me up with some super chat, I mean, all appreciated, not asked for, but you get one of these. Boom, I just funded myself for $92. So, got those going, and uh, obviously all Super Chats those are Spider now Man. Living I Legends up in the top right corner. Friend. So, uh, thank you everybody uh, for stopping by. And with that, now that we've gotten ourselves going, let's create that public session. Feel free to join. We're going to roam around in some Midtown. And... Um, Virgilio's playing on the PC right now. And uh, looks like I got a friendy requesty. So let's go ahead and uh, get that going. Oh, wait. Didn't want to do that. So. Oh, what's happening, Casey Hammer? I am sorry. Uh, do I like Godspeed? I'm not sure. What's happening? Oh, thank you, Chris Moore. Appreciate you. All right, so uh, here we go. Thank you, Cle oh, Kevin Glamorous as well. If you guys are unsubbing and resubbing, I don't hate it. But anyway, um, Anthony LaHue, how am I doing today? I'm doing pretty good. 
Uh, C Bev nineteen ninety four. What's happening? Thank you. Um, do I like Godspeed? I'm not sure what Godspeed is. Are you talking like Godspeed, you Black Emperor? Killer, Killer of Evil forever. Got it. Wow, I can't believe I screwed that up before. Um, Tapping Craig Penfold. I mean, everybody can add me on Xbox because anybody can follow me. I'm interested to see how it works on Xbox. All right, so we got magic here. Um, Cam Stacy said, uh, Cam Stacy recommended it, and I'm like, yo, I missed some magic. I'm gonna play some magic. So. Oh, wow. I am also close to 400 Eternity Splinters, so I don't know exactly who I'm going to buy when I get to the 400. Um, but, yo, I'm not going to lie. Magic is way fun. Oh, we got our first uh, person in the game. We got Lord Yin. Welcome to the game. Godspeed is a villain from the Flash comment, uh, comics. Um, I'm going to be honest with you. I'm not familiar with Godspeed. Uh, it doesn't say join session for you. Um, it should now. I just made it go open. So... He's so fast he can be in three places at once. <laughs> That's pretty cool. I have like no gear for magic whatsoever. Oh, I'm getting my butt whooped. This is probably a bad idea. The rule of thumb should be get yourself some gear <laughs> and then go to Midtown. I lit. Oh, wow, I'm getting like annihilated. Where you at, Lord Yin? You're supposed to have my back. You're my boy, Blue! Alright. So there's literally gear here, and I can't pick it up because... There's all these people on top of it. Oh, somebody else is dead. Oh, we got another Deadpool in the house. <laughs> Jay, can I spoil the Flash Season 3 for you? A oh, Coco, you know better. You know better, my friend. Everybody should check out Darth Coco Production. Does lots of Lego stop motion, uh, which is pretty awesome. Just want the sword. I don't want to revive him anymore. All right. Who we got in here now? We got uh, Burst Flame, 2K15, and Chris M. I think Chris Masterson finally got himself in here. Welcome to the squad, brah. Why you do this? <laughs> uh, so you should be able to just join my session. Um, so let's see. Uh, F-16 Abdullah, welcome to the stream. Uh, my session's open, so you should just be able to, um, if you have me added, just go ahead and join the session. Um, tap and raid plays. Uh, my username is jshockblast on everything. So, alright, let's get some gear in here. I'm pretty sure it even says J Shock Blast on my driver's license. Got that on everything. Everything. Oh no, I think I just deleted some blue gloves. Alright, cool. So, um, will I be seeing the Lego Ninjago movie? Absolutely. Absolutely. Uh, let's see. Uh, what's happening, Alvexis? Uh, 
Thank you, Jar77 Gaming, the orange seller. I appreciate you. Uh, Spider Ghost got that uh, Founders Pack. Disciple of Fear. Oh, all right. Well, if you added me, I'll just go make sure you're on the crew. I seem to be more comfortable on stream. That's cool. I think um, one of the reasons why it might feel that way, might seem that way, is because I can... Uh, yeah, I haven't played Beast yet, Sonny. We're, uh, we're starting out with... Um, we're starting out with uh, Magic. <clears throat> As my voice cracks. Alright, so we've got F-16 Abdullah. And... Who dis? Oh, Disciple of Fear finally added me on that PS4. Alright, so. Um, I don't have anyone. I don't yet have everyone on PC. Should I buy Nick Fury, Magic, or Magneto? Um, honestly, if you want my opinion between Nick Fury, Magic, and Magneto, I personally would say Magic. Second choice, Magneto. Last choice, Nick Fury. I'm gonna be honest with you. Uh, I did not enjoy. I did not enjoy Nick Fury. I think a lot of people are kind of complaining about Nick Fury. So, uh, the official launch of the game. So I think that the um, the the wipe is actually on the 18th now. And then I think op uh, open beta starts for Founder Pack members. And then I think the 23rd is when it starts for uh, everybody. I don't know for sure, to be honest with you. Um, it should say, um, Abdullah, whoever gets it, it should say right here, join session. So I should show up right here, and you should just be able to join session. I have like 160 friends online. <laughs> My username is jshockblast for everything. Even on my driver's license. Um, so who's the best anti-trash mob hero? I mean, any of the characters that can like do a spin, uh, like do the spin move, like Iceman and Nova and um, Captain Marvel, like they are, are pretty good for that. Um, I would say I like Deadpool's like um, he's got the move where you can like throw the the sot little ninja stars in the air. I think it's called like foot daggers. Um, honestly, Hulk he's got like this bash on the ground. Uh, he smashes the ground with his fists, and uh, it's the same thing with Thor with his hammer. I, I think everybody pretty much has an area of effect. So it's happening, Xavier Burns. Um, Aren't they making a full Lego game for Ninjago? I don't know. I've heard that rumor. Um, and what's happening to Xavier Burns' girlfriend? Apparently, you don't have a name. So I'm just going to call you Xavier's woman. And you can smack him for it. It's his fault. Uh, I may get the Deadpool Founder Pack. I think it's a good choice. Like, honestly, I think Deadpool is probably one of the the easiest learning curves in the game. He's really fun, and you get enough uh, G left over that you can probably pick up, uh, you know, Nova and Angela if you really want to. Thank you, Canon 2003. Appreciate you. Uh, says I'm offline. You know what it is? Um, the the game is full right now, so disciple. We'll make sure that we uh, we get you in at some point. Uh, do the villains have the same missions as the heroes? Uh, everything's the same. Yeah. So um, it doesn't matter if you're Magneto or if you're Magic. You're gonna play everything kind of the same. What's happening, Peter Rudolph? <laughs> Her name is Brittany. I'm trying to get Xavier beat up, man. I knew I, I know how to trigger, you know? 
I know how to do it. Xavier's woman. Ha <laughs> ha. Getting you in all the troubles. Call Xavier's girl Lalandra. X fan should get it. The queen of the Shi'ar. So my brother sent me a text message yesterday saying that there are hints of the ra the fraternity of Raptors coming back uh, in in an upcoming comic. I don't know which one. And for those of you that don't know, that would be uh, the type of people that Darkhawk is. So maybe Darkhawk's about to make that comeback. Any idea when this comes to Xbox? Negative Ghost Rider. You can drop out so you can drop in. Yeah, man, I appreciate that. If you want to. Disciple, stand by. Uh, look, oh, we got a drop out. Cool. So, Disciple, you should be able to, to go in. <laughs> Three times I missed you. I think I already said your name, Alvexis. Did magic magic came separately uh, I ran up to um, 7-eleven and I picked up a $20 card against my better judgment because I was like you know I need to have somebody good to come with uh, to come with beast so here's what we're gonna do we're gonna play magic until level 5 and then we're gonna switch back to beast or switch to beast and then when beast hits uh, five levels we're gonna switch back to magic, so we'll uh, we'll just go back and forth. Appreciate you, Panther. I I love my support, man. Apparently, I'm just used to everybody like saying I'm awesome, and you know, apparently that's a thing. Shasta Allen, can I be your dad? Only if it means I get to impregnate your mother. That was probably... I don't know like if that's, if you're trolling or being funny. So, I'm just gonna like go savage mode. And uh, I'm obviously joking. But... Yeah. <laughs> It's very clear that I read that wrong, Shasta. I, I, uh, I apologize. But it was funny, so I don't really regret it either. What's happening, Cam? What's up, Wimpy Blowfish? Someone already snagged it? Nah, man, there's only three people in here. I can have up to four. What happened to Darkhawk in the comics? Is he still alive? So, uh, Chris Powell is Darkhawk. He was in that stupid Avengers Academy comic. And, uh, somebody named Chase from The Runaways, um, ended up taking his, uh, amulet. He was presumed dead, but once, uh, once they found Arcade and, and they found everybody, uh, he was, he was badly injured, but still alive. So, and that was the last we saw of, uh, Chris Powell, so I don't know exactly what's going on. I was not a fan of Avengers, uh, like not Avengers Academy. It was like it was something with Avengers Academy. It was like um, it was uh, shoot. It was the one where like uh, um, I'm blanking. I just said his name too. The option isn't there for you. All right, hold on. Let me go into, oh wait, I know how to do it. Let me go into my um, invite. I have 160 friends online right now. This is gonna be bad. Oh, Scarface got in. <laughs> Sorry, dude. So we'll, we'll get you in. Don't worry. 
Ben Lipson wants me to play as Batman, so that means clearly I need to play as um, Moon Knight. I'm not online for you. I don't know, man. We'll get you in. I, I don't know what's going on. It's hard for me to like adjust for it on screen right now. Um, but we'll, we'll get you in. Don't worry. Because I can see you. And I'm not offline. Um, what did I think of Guardians 2? I thought it was fantastic. I definitely need to see it again. Um, so I'm probably going to see it again at some point this week. It won't be tomorrow because um, first thing in the morning, uh, well, all right, at 10 a.m. tomorrow, I'm going to go to UPS and pick up uh, wave 8 of LEGO Dimensions. Uh, it's literally sitting at UPS two miles from my house right now. Uh, so... It's happening Omicron 17. Am I ready for Deadpool 2? My body is ready. I'll tell you what though, um... I watched uh, the Goonies last night, getting ready for uh, the new Goonie pack I'm going to play tomorrow. And I forgot that Josh Brolin was in that. A young Josh Brolin. Green Lantern is your favorite Marvel? <laughs> ben, you're doing it wrong. Lord Yin likes that spin move. So I'm liking magic so far. I'm looking forward to getting like another power four. I don't really play her much on PC, but I love this costume. Like this costume is is so cool. Oh, what's happening, John Donovan? Say hello to the ladies for me. Hope they're doing well today. Uh, Mr. Chills 13, Magic is 900 uh, Gs or 400 Eternity Splinters. What's happening, my man, Ralph? We failed. How did we fail? There's like 15 of us. Yeah, man, this costume is so awesome for Magic. I love all the Phoenix Force costumes in this game, to be honest. Um, I think... Uh, I love the one, that's my favorite Cyclops costume. Um, I think, I, did they have one for Colossus? I don't remember. It's my favorite Emma Frost costume. I think there's one for her too. Oh yeah. Oh, thanks for the subscription, Zhao. Hi, Zhao. Hi, Ow. I hope I said that right. I'm so bad. Uh, I've been streaming for like 20 minutes. What's happening, Dino Thunder? What's happening, Iverson Groombridge? Got any tips on how to get to 60 fast? Yes, I do. <laughs> uh, the tip is boosts. There's no other way. Uh, play the story. You got to just play through the story. That's the fastest way of getting XP is just ripping through story mode. Um, get as many characters to level 60 as you can. Uh, once you get 10 characters to level 60, you get 100% XP bonus. So that's really the best you can do. Um, and I also found out that once you prestige, and I, it may have always been this way on, on console, I don't remember, but um, once you get to level 60 on uh, on console, you're, it always thinks you're 60. So right now I'm getting a 20% XP bonus uh, for having uh, Nova prestige and Deadpool at 60. So the more characters you have at 60, the more XP you get. Another thing you can do is you want to... I made my video today about the um, Infinity System, which apparently was unnecessary, but, you know, haters going to hate. And if you invest in intelligence, uh, that's going to help you get XP faster, too. Will Jubilee be in this game? I'm not sure. 
All right, Rolf, thanks for stopping by, buddy. I appreciate you. What do I think the next LEGO game will be? I know what the next LEGO game is going to be, allegedly. Uh, do I have Old Man Logan on console? He's on console, but I don't have him. No. I don't foresee myself getting him either, to be honest with you. Um, not a huge Old Man Logan fan. Sorry. I, I hope that doesn't break your heart. Um, but, yeah. Do you want a Deadpool Lego game? I don't know, man. That might be a touchy subject for people. Legend Quest of 50 then story. I screwed that up, Craig. I'm going to be honest with you. Um, I, I... I brought... I brought Star-Lord to uh, Cosmic Prestige. And I did not... I just ripped through the story. So that was my bad. I probably should have done that different. <laughs> a little tear won't lie. <laughs> Sorry, buddy. I like I like Wolverine, but Aw, Alan Baba, thank you for the sub. Does everybody love my dancing Deadpool? I do. I wish that um, I wish there was a, a way that like I could get a notification like that if you liked the video. Does the item change your character appearance at all? Negative. What body part are you sorry to break when someone mentions their love with girl? Uh, uh, um, I don't know. I might have I might have broken a fist or so. No, nah, I mean, to each their own. I mean, I, people are entitled to have horrible taste in comic book characters. That's, like, completely okay to me. Like, I don't know. It's your life. You read the garbage. I'll read the good stuff. I think a lot of my, my disdain for Squirrel Girl, I play up a little bit. Oh, the way she goes, 69. That is a little dirty, but welcome. We appreciate you. <laughs> started your Jean Grey Cosmic today. Forgot how long it takes. Tell me about it. I've got, um... I've got Star-Lord up to... Level... Uh, what do I have him up to? Level 49 Cosmic. And that's with, like, extra uh, boost from the 100% Star-Lord um, boost. So... What can you do, right? But, yeah, I'm going to probably play uh, while I watch the Celtics game tonight. Because I don't think I can stream while I watch the Celtics tonight, man. Uh, it's just the series is intense. Oh, shoot, I didn't want to delete that. Oh, you saw the video for Teddy again? Really hit the heart? Yeah, man. Gaming Elf. Uh, Teddy passed away, like, a little over a year ago now. What's happening, Yonko Malik? Yeah, I'm already feeling for it, Craig, man. It's freaking brutal. Nice, Major Garbear, welcome to the street. Already uh, green prestige on Venom. I was talking to somebody in the chat yesterday. Uh, usually when I'm playing on PC, I close my, um, I close um, like chat so that I just don't have to like see everything. Cause then I'll just start talking to people and um, yeah. So anyway, uh, Somebody hit me up in chat yesterday, uh, like in a whisper, and I would have normally missed it. So if you've ever whispered to me 
on Marvel PC, on Marvel Heroes PC, and I like ignored you. I promise you, it's because I said chat closed. Always better just to hit me up on Twitter and let me know, hey, I'm on that Marvel Heroes PC. I really just roam around randomly, um, like kind of like what we're doing right now. So I like I don't know. I have the super group as well, but I don't really do anything with it. But anyway, I don't really know where I was going with that story. <laughs> um, what did you make of Stallone in Guardians? Well, I could do that all day. Uh, so it's kind of spoilery. So I don't really know if we want to talk about that in stream yet. Uh, what I can tell you about Stallone is... Um, I think we all pretty much knew that he was playing Starhawk. Um, I have one spot open, by the way. So if anybody wants to join, uh, go ahead and get in. Um, so I think everybody knows he was playing Starhawk. And um, I, thought, I thought it made sense, especially with the after credit scene. Um, because all of those characters make up something, and I don't want to really give it away, um, but I, I make sense of it as Stallone is going to be in Volume 3. That's what I make sense of it as. So, uh, my party just opened up a spot, so uh, whoever wants to join, feel free. Yeah, we're going to leave We're gonna leave Guardians alone, though, uh, after that. Uh, sorry, 214. I hope I didn't say too much. Um, but um, I've got a one-week moratorium on Guardians chat, um, so we'll leave it at that. Yeah, we're we're not gonna say anything else. Um, no more no more Guardian chat. It was a fair question, um, but like I want to try to keep the spoilers out of the video and out of the chat because I know a lot of people haven't seen it yet. Um, so we're gonna yeah I'll save it for the review. Uh, I want to see it one more time before I do the review, and then I'll do a review, and we'll uh, we'll do it. Hold on, let me. Oh. All right, we got two open spots now. So I just sent you an invite, um, uh, disciple. So. Yeah, we're going to save all Guardian talk for the review, and then that'll give everybody an opportunity to, uh, to chat in the comments. Uh, we'll, we'll do all that. Aw, oh, Zachary Getzinger, just subscribe. Thank you, brah. I appreciate the people that have seen it that are asking questions. It's like that kind of fine line that you have to walk. Um, of, all right, we're going to go back to Avengers Tower, um, whoever's with me. Uh, it's that fine line you kind of have to walk where, who joined? We got, uh, Lord Ian's back. Hold on, I'm trying to get back to the Avengers Tower so we can switch to Beast. Alright, um... You're not able to. What is going on, Disciple? Uh... There was a free baby group pet yesterday. Yeah, man. I have six of those. Aw, oh, Mr. Chills13. Thanks for the subscribe. Uh... Yeah, I haven't seen anything specific about the new LEGO game. And I have also, let's see, I've never met any MCU actors now. All right, so we're going to go over here. And we're going to switch to Beast. Superheroing is not the most tranquil of applications. All right, and we're going to go to Synergies.
Aw, you. This is what I think of your squirrel girl, Chris. Uh, Free Room Hub's video is not out yet. Sorry. Uh, I'm working on it. Please don't pet me, squirrel girl. By my stars and garters. All right, so we're gonna play the X-Men Beast costume, even though it's my least favorite of the two. Um, let's go ahead and just run through some Hell's Kitchen. Major Garbear says, to me, this will play the role of Marvel Ultimate Alliance 3. And that's fair. Um, Good schoolboy sweatpants. Welcome to the stream. <laughs> Squirrely and the beast. <laughs> I like that. How did I make magic that strong? I didn't really think she was that strong, was she? Uh, they're going to add lots more costumes later, so don't worry about it. Um, the mercury drops they're going to add everything as we go. Drake is one of the warmest people I know. What's happening, Taylor Feldhaus? Welcome to the stream. Thank you so much for joining. Come along on a ride on this fantastic journey with us. You ain't taking me in. Yeah, so like, here's the thing. They're just getting the bases of everything out. Um, why does Beast look like a cat? So this is when he was going through like a, excuse me, like a feline mutation. Beast has had like different versions of his mutation. So this is his feline version. <laughs> Deadpool 4 Infinity War, I wish. How do I even find out about what the next LEGO game is going to be? Well, uh, there was an article on a website. Um, and it talked about the cancellation of uh, LEGO Dimensions. And the person who wrote the article has lots of other info. I also speculate. It, it just makes too much sense. Um... It really just, like, it makes too much sense. So. Yeah. <sighs> All right. This is quite fierce. Oh, you can't open the I chest without me? Head. Kill me, Smalls. I've had enough pointed conversations with Clint Barton. Cam, I expected better out of you. Yeah, You've played this game before. Yeah, no team ups yet. So when the when the spots open up, uh, you're just gonna have to join session. Like I can't really uh, I can't really say for sure what's going on there. Is this game worth buying? I think so. I've spent tons of money on it. Way more than I want to admit to. Nah, Deadpool wouldn't call Thanos Cable. Deadpool knows exactly who Thanos is. They're both obsessed with death. Apparently I already did this part. Thank you, Andrew the Meister. Huh. <laughs> Am I going to play Injustice 2? Absolutely. freaking lootly We're almost a week away. Hey, we've been friends a long time, Hank. I'm not just going to go around sticking gum in your fur. I'm afraid that's beyond my capabilities. I'm actually getting Injustice 2 for Xbox One and PlayStation 4. Why didn't I get that deep XP? 
If you could be a mutant or superhero besides Nova, Deadpool, or Batman, who would it be? Superman. <laughs> Alright, let's be real here, man. Superman has it all. Where are you at, Mr. Chills? Um, I'm assuming Australia or something like that. Or New Zealand. Thank you, Taylor Feld House, for the subscription. Appreciate you. We're on the road for 200,000 subscribers. We are just over 9,000 away. What's happening, Fabu Rocks? Isn't it for the 16th in all regions? I don't think so, no. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna do a subscriber stream. Um, so keeping in mind that you're probably gonna whoop my butt, and I'm gonna try not to be salty about it, I promise. No, wait. I make no promises that I won't be salty about losing, but I will do a subscriber stream uh, for Injustice 2, where you guys can all take turns whooping my butt. As long as I get gear, I really don't care. And just know that if you lose to me in Injustice 2, I am going to talk an insane amount of smack. Like, it's happening. It's gonna happen. I'm going to make fun of you for losing to somebody as awful as me. <laughs> am I gonna play as Red Hood? Absolutely. I mean, so here's the thing. I got to play the beta. Some of you guys know that. Some of you guys don't. I don't know. But I did get to play the beta. And I really love playing as Blue Beetle. So... I might actually make Blue Beetle my main, and I'm not even a Blue Beetle fan, which is crazy. Um, but Blue Beetle was like a ton of fun. So, I don't really, I honestly haven't even thought about it. Thanks, Craig McGee. I appreciate your subscription. We are on the road to 200,000 subscribers. Just hit 190,000, so we're almost there. I mean, in the grand scheme of things, right? Uh, uh, let's see. Have I ever played Power Rangers Legacy? I think somebody asked me that the other day. Um, and I have not. I can look into it. Um... Yeah, so we do have an extra slot now, guys. Uh, if anybody wants to jump in. I'm trying to keep up with chat. Oh, your screen just went black, Disciple? Sorry, dude. If they don't offer a PS3 version, Seriously, I am to not morale, going babe. to bother with this ordeal yeah I, I I hate to say it Tony um, you know PlayStation 3 is uh, thank you Ben's music for the subscription uh, PlayStation 3 is I mean it's, it's done I think PlayStation 3 and Xbox 360 are holding back a lot of games from their full potential on the bigger consoles, so uh, I can assure you this game is not coming to PlayStation 3. It's not coming to Xbox 360 either. And it just kind of is what it is, you know? It's probably not going to the Switch either. Uh, do I prefer X-Men or Avengers? I prefer Avengers, personally. Um, any tips on leveling magic after 60? Um... Well, you don't really need level. I mean, 60 is the cap, so you either prestige or you don't. Is LEGO City Undercover as good as other LEGO games? Yeah, man. Uh, I thought LEGO City Undercover was great. So let's do our Aw, Eric Carlson with the subscription. Up. Thank you. Are you THE Eric Carlson from THE Ottawa Senators? That would be dope. I'm afraid Bet people ask that all the time. Maybe not. Maybe I'm the only one. 
So LEGO City Undercover is probably one of the best values for a LEGO game ever, and that says a lot. So you don't have the benefit of a lot of like characters that you know, but... No, I got you, Tony. Like, don't get me wrong. I, I can appreciate that. It, it's just, it's limiting, you know? Like, it, it's, there's only so much it can do. And, like, the newer consoles, the Xbox One and the PS4, you know, they're, they're so much more powerful. And they're capable of doing so much more. I honestly don't know if this game could run on PS3 or Xbox 360. Um, I mean, it's not like it's super intense, but... Maybe it could. I, I just... It's time, you know? Like, at this point, Xbox One and PS4 have both been out for... Um, over three years, you know? Like, this is year four. So they've been out for three and a half years. And at some point, you just kind of have to... You know, evolve to the next step. Welcome to the game, Dejected Ken. Hopefully this doesn't so it's just, you know, it is what it is. There's nothing you can really do. Like, it's not meant to, uh... It's not meant to, uh... Like, I'm not meaning to offend. Um... Wow, I did not have anything for Beast. But... Like, I mean, especially now that they have, um... Backwards compatibility for Xbox 360. I haven't turned on my, uh... I haven't turned on my 360 in ages. Uh, I have the R2-D2 Xbox 360. I will say, though, uh, we do still use my PlayStation 3. My PlayStation 3 is in the bedroom, and it basically only is used for Netflix because we didn't want to buy a uh, like an Apple TV. So uh, the PlayStation 3 is only used for Netflix. So otherwise, I mean, mine was in perfect condition. I bought my PlayStation 3 so I could play uh, DC Universe Online when that came out, and I just never really got my money's worth out of it. Uh, yeah, the only way I'll get a PS4 is if it drops to 100 or 125 bucks. And I don't know if it's going to go that low, but, uh, you know, uh, there have been ways that you can get it for closer to 200 so, no, I got you, man. Thanks for the subscription, Dark Legend 4565. Uh, I want that Spider-Man Deadpool team-up movie. Dude, you'd be both, Sabrina. I know you're not a dude, I just call everybody dude. Uh, I haven't read any of the new X-Men Blue and Gold yet, so let's be careful there. They need to make Dragon Age Origins and 2 backwards compatible. I gotcha. Have I ever considered doing a day in the life video? Um, maybe. I need to get like a GoPro or something for that. I haven't, I don't know, I don't think what I do is that enjoyable or that interesting. Been playing since I got the code Friday I level 26 Iceman. Nice. Uh, I mean, if it makes you feel better, I've bought like five PlayStation 4s. <laughs> um, I I bought my original PlayStation 4, and then I wanted to get the the white Destiny one. So I had that for a bit. Then it got stolen. You hate the voice of Shocker. Wow! I get a power boost. All right, so we got Beast up five okay. levels. We're gonna take Beast all the way through here. And then we're gonna switch back to Magic. All right. 
Nice, you love Shocker? Do I think Ghost Rider is as good as he was in Ultimate Alliance? He's pretty solid. I've done a Ghost Rider stream, or, well, I've played as Ghost Rider in stream before. I don't think I've done a dedicated Ghost Rider stream. I can't even keep track anymore, to be honest with you. Oh, I love it that Lord Hien is playing uh, Scarlet Witch. Scarlet Witch is really cool. Definitely a very enjoyable character. Not the worst crime I've committed. Oh wow, you still playing your PlayStation 2? That's cool. Uh, when you stream Injustice 2, are we only allowed new characters, or can we play anyone? Ah, uh, dude, honestly, you can play whoever you want. If I do any kind of a stream on, like, a, a DLC day, you know, maybe I'll say, hey, can we only play DLC characters? But, other than that, have at it. My goal, my my game plan for Injustice 2 is going to be, I'm going to play through the story mode first and upload all my videos for that, so I'm going to blow up your notifications that day, sorry. Um, and then once I've I've gotten through the story mode, never be said, I'll, I'll do some streams. So I'm going to have to like kind of figure out a way to kind of do everything like I don't know I haven't I haven't 100 percent figured out how I'm gonna handle that <laughs> J versus a dark side player <laughs> yeah Scarlet Witch has great visual effects so does um Doctor Strange um magic may have been dead at some point I mean, isn't everybody, to be honest? <laughs> so far, my only complaint... I don't love playing as Beast. Um, I feel like I run out of uh, energy too fast. But... I don't know. He's okay. I will say that Beast's uh, ultimate is pretty cool. Hey, what do you guys think? Once I get uh, Ant-Man and Star-Lord back to Cosmic Level 60, should I do a video that shows all ultimates? Since we're not going to be getting a new um, a new video for a while, or a new character for a while. I bet people would want to watch that. All ultimates unlocked. Heh <laughs> Yeah, everybody dies. Like, you haven't lived unless you die. <laughs> In comics, anyway. But. <sighs> Excuse me. How do you mean to. Yeah, see, here's the thing, though, like, I, I don't, like, I think, uh, so Tony V said, you know, when I think harder about this, playing this game will be obsolete by console, because more people play games on touchscreen phone. but here's the thing about touchscreen phones, I think, anyway, I think people that play games that way are ultimately not doing it for the experience, they're doing it for the convenience. There aren't that many games that you can play on a touchscreen phone that are going to be that intuitive and that uh, immersive. Uh, they are always going to be fairly simple games. Sure, you can play on an iPad or, or like a bigger tablet, but uh, I don't really feel like that. 
I don't really feel like that is the same, you know? Heck yeah, all, all ultimates, that's all I need to see is that once. And then Helix Prime agreed. <laughs> Mr. Chills13 says, I wish they'd make a fighting game as good looking as Injustice 2 uh, with all Marvel characters. I concur. Um, so James Reynolds asks, how do I make it so Ice Golem is summoned whenever I go into battle? Uh, you can't. It's a power. You have to summon him. Like, you have to tell him to come out. It's the same thing for all summoners. You have to summon them. <laughs> I'll be honest with you, the only touchscreen games that I really play are Contest the Champions. And I play that when I'm letting the dog outside to run around and, and pee and poop. And I, I play it when I'm on the toilet. Or if I'm like away from home, like it's to me, I don't ever say, "Oh, I want to sit down and play Contest of Champions," you know? Like, unless there's like some character I'm super hard going after. So. Well, all right, all right, all right. We won one. You play Future Fight; they have better graphics than what Gaz does. Yeah, but if you took Future, so Future Fight is first of all on a small screen. Like made for sweet Christmas. Yeah, like it, it's made specifically for handheld to take advantage of that type of a, a screen, you know. Like it has that benefit. If this game was made for for a, a touchscreen phone, then it would probably look as good too. Uh, did I play as Spider-Man? That was my first stream that I did was as Spider-Man. But now that I have his cosmic suit, I'll play him another time. Just thought I'd mention the fact that you may see a lot of... <laughs> Thor, God of Slobbery. Alright. We're gonna switch back. Oh, whoops. Something seems to be playing jump rope with the fabric of reality. Uh, we're gonna switch back to magic. Now that we got Beast up to level 8. Oh, nice cam. Sweet. So, I don't... Let me just check that real quick. Hold on, I'll take out Iceman. Since I can't pull Cam Stacy's screen up. So, we'll pull up Iceman Straight real quick. And we'll go into his skills. Iceman. Under talents. So... Right here. So, when you get to level 32 with Iceman... If you do Golem Mastery, he summons two additional Golems, and those Golems will automatically join you in combat. Perfect. So thank you, Cam. Appreciate you. Um, he's actually the one that's playing no one as Iceman. This is Cam right here. This is me and my buddy Cam. Best buds right here. He's the one that's actually playing Iceman with us. So, uh, yeah, there we go. Now back to magic. He's also the one that recommended I get magic. I'm not going to lie. When he said you should play as magic, I, I said, you're the smartest dude in the room. I, I agree with you. So, the there face. we go. Um, Future Fight is the mobile version of this game. I haven't really played Future Fight, to be honest with you. Oh, Nazir Kimbro, thanks for the subscription. Box. If gameplay on a console can go up to 10, You're not a bot, Future Fight on I mobile has bots. gameplay of about 0.01. You're not a bot, it's very boring very bots. quickly. I mean, you know. Alright, so who we got on the team right now? We got Chris as Nova, Dejected Ken as Wolverine, Lord Yin as Zenpool, and uh, Red Scarface hey, as Iceman. So, I don't want to play the same level again, so let's go back to... Go back down here. Ah! They, they, I keep going over to that door to go down to Midtown, but it doesn't do it here. Uh, I hope one day Gaz offers a playable Sandman. 
It's way too early for a playable Carnage. Um, I do not disagree wrong. with you on Carnage. I'm actually really surprised that's who they went with. Um, but I do think that he, they were getting some, some serious requests for it. Um, why I, Iceman had the orb around him because of one of the artifacts I had active. Aramis Marks, uh, do you think they should add Mantis? Yeah, man. Uh, if they were... See, here's the thing that disappoints me a little bit. Um, I really feel like instead of adding another Drax and another um, Gamora, they really should have added a Mantis and a Yondu as far as, um, you know, play or uh, team-ups. But, you know, they already they basically slapped new skins on uh, Drax and Gamora, and that was that. I mean, I get it, don't get me wrong, but... But that's also one of the reasons why I think we should have playable Drax and playable Gamora, because they already have two character models for them, you know? Or two, um... Whatever you want to call them. Two costumes. Yeah, as soon as somebody drops off ZBA, uh, somebody could, uh, we'll have somebody bounce in. Or we'll have you bounce in. Like, uh, honestly, it's tough, man. First come, first serve. Um, maybe at some point we'll have somebody bounce out. Um, <laughs> you got a new playable, it would be too OP. If you like a, a fire-based character, who would you recommend for a starter? Um, I would probably say, um, what's his face, uh, Ghost Rider. Uh, Ghost Rider is probably the, the only fire-based. I mean, Human Torch would have obviously been a choice, but I don't think they're going to be bringing the Fantastic Four over anytime soon. Gets them every time! Add Baby Groot as a skin. <laughs> How do I feel about Batista as Drax? Well, if you've ever read any of Dra Drax from, uh, like, Annihilation Conquest or any of the other comics, he is wicked smart. Like, and, and that's not Batista's fault. I think Batista did, you know, Drax proud. Um, it's just, I don't think James Gunn wrote Drax properly. They made him an idiot when Drax is actually, like, wicked smart. Chris said he has to go soon, so uh, his spot will be open up soon. Yeah, I agree with Cam. Spider-Woman, I really thought they would add her, and I don't really think that it's going to, like, take much to add her, you know? I also can't believe they didn't, like, they haven't added Falcon, you know? Like... Or call him whatever you want, you know, Sam Wilson. Um, because they have uh, two different Falcon skins, and they have a uh, Sam Wilson Captain America skin. So, like, I just kind of feel like they should have added you know, either one of them. And Groot, a playable Groot, they have, like, five different Groot skins. Like, I, I think that's, like, half the battle is whether or not you have, like, a skin that they can use to play with. Yeah, people are uh, unhappy about Unworthy Thor. I'm not going to lie. I don't blame them. I did not think they would make a separate character for Unworthy Thor. Like, I understand why they're doing it. He does have a different skill set. But I just don't think anybody's clamoring for it, you know? Yeah, both, both of the choices they made for characters this year are a little suspect. Uh, what's happening, Mr. Slayer2377? Actually, I think it was you that were... Were you the one I was chatting to last night? 
on uh, on heroes. I can't remember. Jean Grey is fire too. Yeah, that's a good point. <laughs> Every time I watch a stream, I get more excited to play this game. Well, that I take that as the highest compliment. Holy cow! Somebody just drove by my house with a motorcycle so fast. Or so loud. If I can hear something outside from my my office, which is in my basement, uh, it's loud because I'm hearing impaired. And uh, yeah, limited skills is gonna hurt the game in the long run. I mean, the game is what it is. I mean, you can't have more than eight skills on console. I think it's fine. Um, Venom or Spider-Man, which is my favorite? I would say I probably personally prefer playing as Venom. And my favorite Spider-Man skin on PC is Civil War or End of... Uh, I can't remember what it's called. It's like Edge of Reality or End of Time. or It's the one where he's wearing like actual armor. That's my favorite Spider-Man. Tapping in Arcanite 7. No, Emma's not on PS4 yet. I don't like Emma though. I, I do kind of miss dash. There are definitely times where I'm like, I don't have my dash and I wish I had it. Um, but it's not as awful. I'm getting used to not having it. I also always use the, the skill that gives you four more. Or that gives you four. So it gives you the extra dash. Ends of the Earth. Yeah, I always screw that, that up. You represent the That's my second favorite Spidey costume. I think it's in a... Uh, I can't remember. It might. The only way you can get that might actually be in a fortune card, though. Ends of the Earth and Civil War, my two favorite Spidey costumes. Did they change Emma? I honestly haven't played her in a while. Like I got her to uh, green, like green prestige, uh, prestige green sixty, and that was not that long ago. But I don't know if it was before or after they changed her. I I did not enjoy her like at all. I mean I hate. She was actually one of my least favorite characters. <laughs> It'll grow back. All right, I need to just delete all of these. I have, I'll get them again. Killing my inventory. Huh. <laughs> Do I watch a lot of horror movies? No, I am I'm a complete nut of wood. Uh Craig Penfold says they said that they add people when they find ways to make them interesting to play. They also said that team ups don't translate to interesting to play. No, I mean, I get it, but like, I feel like how hard is it to make Drax or Gamora interesting to play, you know? Like, how difficult is it to make Falcon interesting to play? I don't feel like it's that difficult, you know? I Honestly, out of all the team-ups, the one that I want to be able to play the most is uh, Archangel. Uh, 
Uh, we did pick up somebody. We picked up ET Game 7. So welcome to the game, buddy. Um... But it really doesn't work with my mask. <laughs> yeah, as far as horror movies go, I started answering that question. I didn't finish it. Um, I, I'm a wuss. I do not like horror movies. And the funniest thing is, my birthday is Halloween. I was born on October 31st, Halloween. My first name is Jason. My middle name is Michael, like Michael Myers. And I don't like horror movies. Like, I'm very jumpy. One of my favorite stories to tell people about how jumpy I am, uh, and which is why... Oh, look at that. There's Punisher's ultimate. Uh, one of my favorite stories to tell people about how... Um, how jumpy I am... Uh, there was a movie called Mr. Baseball. Uh, I think it had Bernie Mac, and he played for the Milwaukee Brewers. And he retired after 3,000 hits. And he called, or not Mr. Baseball, Mr. 3,000. And he retired after 3,000 hits. And then, like, Major League Baseball did some kind of a study, and they took a bunch of his hits away. So he had to come out of retirement to try to get them back so he could keep on calling himself Mr. 3,000. So I went to see that with like five friends in college and there's a scene in the movie where he hits a foul ball and the camera follows the foul ball all the way up to the camera and I like, I didn't jump but I like, I leaned back when it happened and I got laughed at so hard for that and I deserved it. So. They should have Mysterio. I like. I, I would like that. The Iron Spider deal from Spider Verse was supposed to be Doc Ock. Uh, Jason Voorhees is extremely jumpy. How he handles it is kind of fun. Um, I'm named after Jason from the horror movies. My mom would name me Jason Michael Freddy. <laughs> That's funny. I was not named after Friday the 13th. I was born in 1980. I don't even think it was out yet. Holy cow, that dude is a purple prestige? I know that's not really that great, but like, dude, you're in like, closed beta. If anybody is gonna be mad about the wipe, it's gonna be Marcelo over there. That's crazy. Well, good for him though. He's playing a lot of Thor. Darkness and hurt given forth. What's happening, Andrew Melfi? Yeah, I was born October thirty first, nineteen eighty. Although I would not care to try. Hey, bud. Do you want Spectacular Spider-Man for Spider-Verse movie? Um, I honestly don't really care what they do as long as they just make it interesting, you know? Like, I'll, I'll watch whatever Spidey movie they give me. When does this come out for Xbox One? I don't know for sure. What's the best character to start the game with if you're new? Well, I mean, it depends. Um, how are you starting, first of all? What I've been telling people is with your first 400 Eternity Splinters, like, it's really great value if you get Angela and Nova uh, because they're 200 Eternity Splinters each. And, I mean, they're super cheap. So that'll get you two characters right away. And everybody should start with uh, Daredevil. So there's that, too. Give me a moment. I'm putting a hoodie on. Uh. 
Uh, they don't have Scarlet Spider TV games on the PlayStation, on the console yet, but I'm pretty sure they do have it on, uh, PC. Uh, what's happening, Ashton Ego? Greetings from the son of Asgard. Igo? I don't know if I got it right. You're not a bot, are you? I hate bots. Alright, cool. <laughs> Look at this dude. Marcelo goes. Marcelo, I have no idea. But he's purple. <laughs> How much is Iceman 900? Here isn't always the solution, though. Uh, Daredevil is one of the few you dislike. You accidentally bought Ant-Man instead of Angela. Ant-Man's cool too, though. Does the game have a story mode? It does, Ahmed. Ahmed Diallo. Welcome to the stream, by the way. <sighs> Excuse me. Oh, that's so rude. Um, I mean, honestly, I think they're going with Homecoming. I don't really care what they do for Spider-Man. Um, I'll watch whatever they put up there. Like, the Spider-Man movies, I think, are always pretty good. Do you want do you want Spawn to be in Injustice 2? Yes. I think that'll be great. You'll never take me alive. <laughs> Tony V says, I can't wait to hear the Wonder Woman previews and how many turd, turd nerds fap their asses off in the theaters <laughs> that's good I like that I'm actually looking forward to Wonder Woman um, it'll be interesting to see how they do I don't like them wasting uh, Chris Pine on like what who is he Steve Trevor is that his name so Uh, what if you start with Spidey? Uh, not bad. Spidey's not that bad. I think you'll enjoy Spidey. Spidey's not my favorite character in the game, but he's still pretty cool. Uh, the game... <laughs> Captain Nova Gamer 57. Captain Scorpion. Uh, so we're still on closed beta. Um... It will be free once it's not in closed beta. Oh yeah, I forgot that I have uh, a beta key that I can give away. Uh, so this is a shout out to Drew2097. Um, give me a second here, I can uh, type out this code. And I'm just gonna put the code right in chat, so. First come, first serve in chat. Let me know that you got it. This is a North American code. Six. J M E. So this is gonna go into chat. First come, first serve. And here it is. And that is courtesy of Drew2097. Uh, what's happening, Shazdy1409? What's with the monkey thing that follows magic? Those are her summons. Uh, she can summon these little demons. Um. Ah! <laughs> Just turned my PS off and now you give the key away. But you already have the game, though. <laughs> Can't be excited for DC films after bored in the cinema watching Suicide Squad. I thought Suicide, Suicide Squad was okay. Just okay, though. If Marvel Heroes was a full-price game, but I still buy... I mean, I've already spent more money on it than I would a, a full-price game, so... 
Mr. Reaper 2003 said he started with Black Widow and she's level 44. Mr. Slayer 2377 asked, how is Silver Surfer on PC good? And yeah, Silver Surfer's a lot of fun. Is Black Panther in the game? Yes, he is. I don't have enough to get him though. Um, if somebody uses that code, let me know. How many splinters do I have? Ooh, 305. We are 95 Eternity Splinters away from 400. I'll probably unlock, maybe I'll unlock uh, Black Panther at that point. Can EU play with North America? Yes. How about your progression after beta? So they are doing a wipe on the 18th. And after the 18th, everything that you get for leveling is is good to go from from then on. So you you only lose the progression after the one wipe. You betrayed the code. I don't know what you mean. Yeah, the game is very addictive. I'm seriously starting to it's PlayStation. It's only on... Yep, I put the, the code in the... Code's in the chat. Let me uh, copy it again. I'll put it in chat again. I don't know if anybody got it, though. So you gotta let me know if it's redeemed. Uh, beta is supposed to end on the 16th, I believe. Do I have Marvel Future Fight on my phone? I do not. Oh, you betrayed the code, I get it. Yeah, 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 I got the Guardians reference now, my bad. Yep, anybody can add me. Um, it would not let you use the code. You have to be uh, North America. <laughs> I'm sure you're happy with because of the wife gets rid of the squirrel girl that I bought. Yep. <laughs> and I'm not buying her again. Anytime soon, anyway. Does GameSpot still have codes? Yes, they have like 50,000. Uh, any, I have one spot open, so if anybody wants to join, feel free. Let me just make sure I have everybody added. Oh, I have one more friend request. Nope. We're good. I wish it didn't have to be this way. So when the beta ends, no one will be able to play. No, when the beta ends, the full game launches. So once the full game launches, everybody, the free to play will kind of kick in and anybody can play. So actually more people will be able to play once the beta, the closed beta ends. Once the full beta, the, um, once the open beta ends, then it's just released. We're good. I have Future Fight on my phone, but I just haven't really gotten into it. All right. All right, Darth Gamer 2003 got got in. That's Mr. Reaper 2003. Um, 
So if anybody is watching that's been in for a little while, if we can try to get somebody else in. Yeah, man, I, I, I have an alliance on uh, Contest of Champions. Uh, it's called Death of Hope. So if anybody wants to join that alliance, feel free. I'll be honest with you, I just don't play mobile enough. So. Aw, oh, Ghost4193, thanks for the sub. Nah, this game is fine, Tony. This game is doing just fine. There are very few bugs at all on this. I mean, there's always going to be bugs. I mean, it's a small studio. I, I honestly have not had any significant issues on PC either, so I'm not sure exactly what the problem is. But I mean, I know that there have been issues. I, I don't dispute that, but... I just don't run into them personally. Doesn't mean they don't exist. Do I ever play DC Universe Online? I bought a PS3 for it, but um, I uh, I didn't play it too much. I didn't enjoy it that much. It's one of those games I kept telling myself I'd get back to. Aw, Shazny1409 with the subscription. Thank you. Or the... I don't know, whatever you call it. Yeah, a subscriber. Uh, yeah. I might as well just get that out of the way right now. Did anybody claim the other code? All right, we've got an open slot. Thank you, uh, there was Lord Yin that dropped out. So whoever wants to drop in. Okay, somebody, all right, Curtis Woods said something, got it. All right, so I have one other code uh, for North American. Aw, oh, Aramis Marks, thank you for the sub. Let me do the other code now. Uh, J4AQA9MP. Thank you, April Floyd, for the sub. PFC. I just read it out, so if anybody was paying attention, uh, you might have gotten a head start. Thank you, Mauricio M. All right, there's code number two, North America. All right, Shanzi, we'll see ya. Thanks, Helix Prime, for stopping by. We'll see you later. Appreciate ya. Chris Masterson says, I played Scroll Roll level 10. Even though I hate her, I found her good to play as. <laughs> you need a code that'll work in Africa? I don't know if I got those, but I wish. I wish the code just worked wherever. I honestly don't know anything about what DC Universe Online is, is like these days, so. You know what happened is my main character in DC Universe Online that I played on PlayStation 3, I started it with my buddy Mike, and he wanted to do a, a player versus player server, and I just got to the point, oh, Joseph Hagen subscribed, thank you, buddy. Uh, I just got to a point where I couldn't even walk out of the police station because there were people just standing by the police station waiting to, um, Here's to new memories. like waiting to, uh, what do you call it? Like just rip us. So, ah, uh, Anth Andrew the Meister got it. <laughs> You'll never get code. Dude, Nova Gamer, just go to GameSpot. All you have to do is like their stuff on... Facebook, Twitter, a couple places. 
give him your email and then just unsub to it all. Sorry, dude. I just threw it in the stream. And that is courtesy of Drew2097. So thank you to him. Can't figure out how to join me. I got two open slots. So if you look on the now playing screen, there should be something that says join session. Uh, wh what's your screen name, James? You should be able to just join my session. What's happening, Cal the Breeze? Welcome to the stream. Uh, do we have GTA? I have it on Xbox One, but I haven't played it in years. Um, I got it when it came out on Xbox One really cheap, but uh, I haven't played it. All right, you got it. There you are. Aluminum loot. We got another Iceman in the, in the game with Scarface McGee. So the Celtics game is going to be starting up in about a half hour. So I've got about 15 minutes left in the stream. I think joining would be so much easier on Xbox One. I think so, too. Yeah, Sam Parkins, you can... Oh, looks like somebody tipped the last slot. We got Murder Deadpool in here. So, uh, yeah, it, honestly, when I open up my game, anybody can join. Like, feel free. Um... If I don't open up my game, that probably means I'm just trying to play alone. Uh, but uh, I'll open up my game, and if anybody ever wants to join, they can feel free. That's that's going to be the golden rule. Uh, also, keep in mind that I have notifications turned off. So if you like send me a message or something like that, I will never see it. <laughs> um, because I just get too many. Like, what happens is people will see that I'm streaming and they'll, like, start sending messages and stuff, trying to get their name on the stream. The worst, though, what drives me nuts is I keep forgetting to turn it off on my, uh, my Xbox One that's in my living room. And I'll be sitting watching Netflix or HBO Go with my girlfriend, and, like, people are, like, sending me messages and party invites. And it's like, dude, you see that I'm on Netflix. Why are you sending me party invites? And I don't join party. Sorry. It's a good way to annoy somebody. And now I shouldn't have admitted that. Just swiping it air while I'm reading chat. When is the overall beta end? May 23rd is when that beta ends. Is that open beta ends then? Because that's the number that I've heard too. Oh. Trash Panda. What do I watch on Netflix? Um, whatever I can, really. Um, I don't, like... Like, we were watching... We'll watch movies. Um, it's not always just Netflix. Like, today, we are watching HBO Go uh, so that she could watch uh, last week's episode of Silicon Valley that she hadn't seen yet. Um, My demonic side is getting the best. I really hate that you can't teleport through things on console. Drives me nuts. Huh. 
Josiah is fashionably late as usual. Am I doing something wrong? I'm level 30 and I'm on chapter 9. Shouldn't I be like level 50 now? Uh, not necessarily. Um, is it bad that I go back to old vids? Absolutely not. All my vids are the same to me. As long as you watch the ad. Can you quickly send a link to that GameSpot site from a while back? Yeah, well, I'll have to find it, but I'll do it for you. Oh, actually, it was saved in my... Uh, well, that was actually easy. Perfect. Explosions attract the coveted 18 to 24 year old male demographic. Excuse me. If anybody's still looking for a code, you can go to that GameSpot link. They still have like 50,000 codes left. And it's really easy. You just have to like like them on Facebook, like them on Twitter, like them on Instagram. There's like five things you have to like, and then you just have to give them your email, and you'll have a code within like an hour. It's like so easy. Have I seen Arrow? Arrow's like my favorite show. Like, I love Arrow so much that I actually have a bottle of Stephen Amell's wine in my closet. Um, he made, he has his own vineyard um, and called Mocking Point. And I actually have a bottle of his wine. I'd have it shipped to my brother in Florida because Massachusetts won't let you ship alcohol uh, to, their, to the state, so. I'd have it shipped to my brother in Florida who then like shipped it to me. Can you dash as much as you want? No. How does one become a moderator? Man, I did not sign up for this. By not asking. <laughs> um, I am very stingy with the moderator. Um, I'm going to be a lot honest with you. Like that is uh, that's a high honor and I, I don't just give it to anybody, and yeah, so it's kind of like a, a need basis. How about EU code? Sorry, dude. It's, uh, the, so the codes for GameSpot are North America only. It's happening, Flame Skull. Thank you so much. That, I'm glad you love my videos. I appreciate that. Yeah, the Mod Wrench, man. If you earned yourself a Mod Wrench... You are a long timer, and or I know you personally, and you. It, it's. I appreciate everybody. Trust me, it's. It's a hard thing to like, play favorites or whatever. But like, I'll tell you what. Cam Stacy has absolutely earned his mod wrench. If anybody has, he's probably high up on the chart is of people that's earned their mod wrench. So I got mad respect for Mr. Red Scarface. He even owns one of my J Shock Last t-shirts, which is awesome. I wish that they gave out, like, other things other than mod wrenches. Like, I don't know. Uh, so after the wipe, do your characters carry over to the main game? The characters that you purchase with, um, with founder packs do. Any G that you purchase gets refunded back to you. And anybody that you, uh, anybody that you purchase with, um, with Eternity Splinters, you, you lose. So you have to re-earn your Eternity Splinters. The good thing though is that once you beat the first, um, whatever you call it, um, whenever you beat the, the prologue for the first time, you get 400 Eternity Splinters. So that'll give you uh, at least two characters, maybe three, because you're gonna start with Daredevil. Now, I'm telling people that with your first 400 Eternity Splinters, uh, you can't do much better than getting Angela and Nova, so. We'll see you, Saeed. Ah, uh, 214 Gaming, I like it. Uh, gonna earn that mod wrench someday. Well, I will hold you to that. 
And on that day, we will have a celebration. <laughs> Cam Stacy, also, I highly recommend the t-shirts. They are super comfy. They are, man. Like, I thought they came out pretty good, man. The colors uh, were not like, um, I think you got one of like the, the bluish kind of teal ones, if I remember correctly. And that wasn't really my choice of a color, um, but I liked it a lot. Uh, that was one that uh, my, my partner, like all the design stuff, all the t-shirts, or wait, did you get the one with like the, the sleeves that had the, uh, like the comic characters on it? I can't remember. Um, it, um, like my partner, Broadband TV, did all the design work and everything. I kind of gave them an idea of what I wanted, and they just kind of like had free reign. And the, the tealish blue color wasn't my first choice, but, um, I've grown to really like it. So, uh, what's happening to Zach Bergen? Um, We'll see you later, Rogelio. Oh yeah, you got the... I, I thought I remembered you having the comic book style one. See, the red was my choice. Um, I wanted red. And... The teal blue one, they kind of came up with. And I like how it came out. Um, I think that's pretty sharp. But, like, the, the comic book sleeve ones... Like, that was 100% their idea. And when she described it to me before I actually saw it, I was kind of like, yeah, I don't know about that. But then I saw it, and I'm like, yo, that's cool, man. And, like, the Thor t-shirt is just icing on the cake. So. <laughs> Craig don't need no stupid wrench. He just loves being here. I love having you here, buddy. And as you know, I recognize that you are a very long time sub. I am starting to get used to a lot of these names, um, so like, the only thing that throws me off is when you have a different screen name than your YouTube name, and like I have to see it in, um, like on Xbox or PlayStation. Like that's kind of confusing me because there's just so many people. Like I don't think you guys have any idea, like I have, I have 163 friends online right now or something like that. And then if you go into my profile, how many friends does it say I have now? So on PlayStation, it says I have 680 friends now on PlayStation. And on Xbox One, I have 207 friends and over 1,100 followers. It's freaking insane. Does Symbiote Spidey have a different move set? No, it's just a costume. The tentacles are cosmetic. Uh, Sabrina, someday I'll be your best friend. I like it. What's happening, Pedro? It's okay, Josiah. Uh, I think you said to call you Josh, if I remember correctly. So I'm going to just call you Josh and assume. Um, it, honestly, like, I'm, like, very protective of my channel. Um, like, most of the time when I give out the mod wrench, I tell people, you don't have to actually do any modding. Like, I usually catch everything myself. But, like, I'll tell you what, man. Cam Stacy has, on multiple occasions, caught Guardian spoilers that I didn't even see. So, I gotta give him mad props. He's like number one moderator. I, I'm not gonna lie, he's definitely my best mod. Um, not that anybody else, like, I mean, I, if I tell you, hey, you don't have to do anything, and then you don't do anything, like, that's not your fault. <laughs> but, um, yeah. Mod slots, gotta be earned. So, um, I think I already said what's up, Pedro. Uh, what will... 
will that thing with GameSpot affect me if some of my accounts have different emails? No. No, it'll just recognize. You'll get a little check mark next to each time that you do it. Um, you'll get a little check mark saying that they know that you did it. And then once all the check marks are there, there, they'll go ahead and send you the code. I think I got my code within an hour. So it's usually pretty quick. All right, so what time we got? We got 6.15, all right. We're gonna do five more minutes and then it's Celtics game time. Oh yeah, forgot about Twilight. I'm gonna go watch the Celtics. So I finally got magic, she flies it looks like. Nice two level ups, is magic my main? Uh, Mauricio, no, uh, I actually just got magic today. My main is my main is gonna be Deadpool and Nova. These are my mains right here. Deadpool and Nova. After reaching level 16 and beating the game, what's the best way to level up other characters? Um, so each time you level up, you get an extra 10% uh, XP bonus up to 100%. So actually, we'll just go up to. Um, We'll go up to the tower since we're ending the stream in a minute anyway. Yeah, James, no problem. I'm glad you're able to join in. So here's what I'll show you uh, once we get up to the tower and I'm out of the way. My voice is starting to get raspy too, I think. At least it feels that way. Um, so, whoops. When you go into your um, buffs, you'll notice on your stat line. Um, if you scroll all the way down on your stat line, it's gonna show you your utility stats. So right now, I have XP bonus of 20%. So with the 20% XP bonus, uh, I'm getting, or I'm sorry, hero synergy bonus. That is the, the bonus XP I'm getting right now. So for that, I'm getting Deadpool is giving me plus 10% and Nova is giving me plus 10% because if you look, I already have Nova prestige once. Uh, so he's level 30, but on the green prestige. So like when I, when I call in Nova, um, he's got the green name. So, and then for Deadpool, he's just a level 60. So once you hit level 60 and then prestige, the game recognizes you as being a level 60. So, you know, I always thought that you had to keep everybody at level 60, but it literally doesn't care. So, um, here's his uncanny costume. So, uh, there you go. Jack Miller just joined. Oh, I'm ending the stream. I'm sorry, buddy. Um, did I pass Cosmic Trial with Deadpool? No, I didn't even try, to be honest. Uh, which character is more fun, Punisher or Hawkeye? Uh, me personally, I would say Hawkeye. Um, I don't mind Punisher, but I like Hawkeye a little bit more. How do you get your first character to 60? Because I've just started Chapter 9, and I doubt he's going to shoot me up 30 levels now. Um, honestly, uh, Legendary Quests. So the, easy, the best way to level up is Legendary Quest. How do you prestige and what does it do? Uh, so for, you know, Deadpool, we'll go to Deadpool and you know, a guy could go crazy being so for like prestige, <laughs> you go down here to one of the vendors. It all, all it really does is it just kind of gives you a, uh, it just gives you like a different color acknowledgement, you know? So you go down to here and you buy the certificate of prestige and it basically starts your level over at level one, and you'll be green. Um, you you get a couple boosts, and you get a couple things like that. So, uh, screw it. We'll just go ahead and do it for Deadpool. Alright, so we bought a Certificate of Prestige with Deadpool. How do you do Legendary Quests? If you look on the right-hand side of the screen, underneath a doomed world, it says, uh, Strong Arm the Streets. Once you hit level 60 and beat the game for the first time, uh, you end up getting um, 
you unlock legendary quests. So you just basically right now, if I went to Midtown and I defeated uh, 200 enemies and destroyed 200 or 20 cars, I'll get a bunch of uh, different, you know, things. So uh, I'll, I'll get like a bunch of extra XP. So basically, I just bought the um, the prestige, and we're gonna go into supplies and not crafting. All right. So, wait, hold on. It's not letting me use it. Inventory, supplies, consumables. This item is not usable. Use the shield to have your prestige. Cannot be used. All right, so it can't be used while in party. So, I'm going to drop out of the party. Sorry, guys. And we'll go back into here. Supplies consumables and we're gonna use it and just like that and just like that my Deadpool is back to being level one for an afternoon doc as you can see I have the green tag above my name so and with that we also got uh, some new consumables so, hold on, uh, delivery. So under delivery, we got the prestige flourish and the prestige gift. So let's unlock that. And Iron Man. Uh, Iron miscellaneous Man. prestige gift. <laughs> it's an item to earn small rewards for beginning new prestige rank. A random boost in five eternity splinters cannot be used in the hubs. So let's go down. It's a little different on console. On PC, you would actually get... Um, when you prestige, you would actually get a new costume. Which you could just basically use in the grinder. Alright, so let's go back to inventory. Supplies. And my prestige gift is... I have no idea what I got. Oh, all right. So I got five Eternity Splinters and a Shield Supply Boost. So... Uh, my Supply Boost. So gain Shield Supply Boost for 30 minutes. Consuming more Shield Supply Boost will raise the amount gained after five sacks, blah, blah, blah. So, all right. So I guess I'm gaining the Shield Supply Box is... Uh, pretty quick so Psh, oh wow cam's earning his money today even though i don't pay him we're just gonna go ahead and block wesley screw it so thank you so much uh cam that is why you were there <laughs> who the f are you talking to man dude i'm talking to the people that are watching Come the stream on, you stupid Boosting idiot squirrel. So, anyway. Uh, thanks for letting me play earlier, bro. Dejected Ken. You're one of my favorite YouTubers. Thank you, Jose. I appreciate you. Um, I'm going for gold with Deadpool eventually. So, uh, anyway. Uh, you just joined. We're just ending. <laughs> Wesley needs an English tutor. Cool. <laughs> Alright, guys. Well, thank you so much for watching. Um, we'll do another Deadpool stream soon so we can get him leveled up a little bit more. Um, there we go. So, uh, I'm going to go watch the Celtics game now. So, love y'all. Uh, thank you again for a wonderful stream. And we'll see ya.